Alrighty, looks like we're live again. Hey there, everybody. It's a nasty one here again, and welcome back to the next episode of the Heat of Shuffle Draft Franchise Rebuild here in Super Mega Baseball 4, year number three. Last episode, we took on the Crocodons for the only time this season, and we got a complete game shutout out of a veteran purred Lovelorn as he took the Crocodons to task and gave us an easy 5 nothing cruising victory in our first ball game at Wacker's Wheel here in the series. That uh, leads us into our final road game of the first half of the season, ending this five, get stretch of five straight road games. Uh, heading over to, once again, Shaka Sports Turf, my least favorite ballpark in this entire universe. Uh, we'll be taking on the Buzzards. It's the only time we'll see them this season, and it's the third straight year in a row that we have faced them on the road. And I believe we lost both games against them. So I'm looking to turn our luck around. On the mound today is Reese Hunter, 1-0 with a 3 ERA and a 1-1-7 whip for, our, for us. It's the sophomore pitcher. And on the mound for the 3-3 three three Buzzards, it is veteran K. O'Neal, one of the former sirloin starter, 1-0 with a 9 ERA and a 3 whip. Neoma's only victory came in relief in an extra innings appearance in her second appearance of the season. Her one start didn't go so well. But she's given up a run in every inning she's pitched this season, so we'll see if we can take advantage of that. Lineup we're going to use for the game. Leading off in left field is Big Country Buck Swiner, followed by locked in right fielder Jovan Bambino. Batting third in at shortstop Norm Phenomeno. Batting fourth, locked in at third base Keg Gutterson. Batting fifth, first baseman Grunt Manley. Batting sixth is center fielder rookie Stanley Swanson. Batting seventh, second baseman Sloop Whoopity. Batting eighth, catcher Fiona Clark. And batting ninth is the pitcher Hunter. Let's go ahead and jump into it and get it on today as we head out to Shaka again. God, I hate this ballpark. All right, looking at the Buzzards this year, they put all their money into power hitting, it appears. Uh, speed, defense, and bullpen are only average at best. Contact and starting rotation are only a little bit above average. Back down a bit. Seemed a little loud. There we go. All right, on the map, we're up first today. Big Country will lead us off here against Neomo. Big Country hitting 381 in the air with one homer, four RBIs, and his volatile trait always active, of course. Uh, be the first batter to face former Sirloins, uh, righty Ko Neomo. Ko on the year one and zero. She has a nine ERA and a three WHIP. Four earned runs given up in four innings pitched. Two appearances, one say one relief appearance, one start. She got the win in the relief appearance. Ten hits surrendered, two walks, one homer, four fifty five batting average against. One strikeout, two walks, no homers. Okay, and her advanced stats for those of you curious, of course. Looking over there, I'm not impressed. <laughs> All right, big country getting ready to lead it off here against her. Let's see how it goes. You're taking the letters for a strike. Go on. That cutter just caught the top of the zone to buck. Fast bump away is chopped to short right at Nance Tools. And that's an easy first out for the Buzzards today. Next up, right fielder Jovan Bambino locked in hitting 429 with two homers, four RBIs on the season. Cutter up and in, strike called a one. Fast bumping away is fouled off late 0 2. Bambino behind. Change up at the knees out in front of it as he pulls it foul. 0 2. Remains the count. Fastball away. Rope to left center field over the leaping tools. His glove into the gap. That'll be extra bases for Bambino as the center fielder tracks it down. Man and Moon gets it in, but it is a one out double for Yovan as he puts himself in scoring position. Next up is shortstop Norm Phenomeno, the two-way player, hitting 409 with four homers. Not every eyes on the air. Here up, struck called. 0-1 as Neomo puts fastball in there. Slider way outside in the dirt. 1-1. One one. Change up and away. Rocketed dead center field by Norm. That is crushed deep dead center field here at the deepest part of the park. Fireball coming at you there as he gets it out over the high, the deep wall in dead center straight away in front of the batter's eye. Norm hits it 446. Fifth homer of the year for Norm and the Peters are quickly out to a 2-0 lead. I did not expect that to get out and that was a pleasant surprise. Okay, Gutterson up next. Third baseman locked in hitting 500 with the homer. Three RBIs as Neomo tense. Hit it right down the middle for a strike. Go one. Fast bump is chased out of the zone line softly to second. Caught by Hautier. Two down. Base is empty for first baseman Grunt Manley. Hitting 391 with three homers. Four RBIs on the year for Grunt. Heater up. Strike called at the letters. Go one. 
Change it. Caught the inside corner. 0-2 to Grunt. Peter outside. No one in the zone. 1-2. Fastball put in. One hopper to second. Hautier makes the play, and that ends the inning. The two in on the homer by Phenomeno. Peter's quickly out to a lead. Bottom one. Up first for the buzzer today, Nance Tools, Peak Physique, and Javier Hautier, three infielders. Nance Tools leading off at shortstop today, former Moon Star star, hitting 174. Two RBIs on the air. She'll be the first batter to face sophomore pitcher Reese Hunter, the righty. Hunter on the air, 1-0 with a 3 ERA and a 1-1-7 whip. Two earned runs given up in her first start of the year, which was a quality start. Six innings, six hits, one walk, seven strikeouts. Batting average against 261 on the air, and her advanced numbers, for those of you curious, are right there on the screen for you. It's a lot better than the Omos. <laughs> Lineup for the Buzzards today. After Tools, it is locked in third baseman Peak Physique. Uh, then it is second baseman Javier Hautier. Batting fourth, locked in in center field, Man and Moon. Batting fifth, playing first base today, is normally the catcher, Tara Leonair. Batting sixth, left fielder Filet Jones. Batting seventh, rookie right fielder Edwin Pruitt. Batting eighth is... Uh, Third-year catcher, Cozy Spooner, he's locked in. And then it's pitcher Keo Neomo on the bench. They have Johnny Bags, who is sitting out today because he's injured and also tense. Yips Frazzler, the young infielder, I guess. Uh, Rusty Buston, the former Moon Stars player. Uh, D.P. Turner. Bad Hop Brown, and then moving to the rotation, they have Donk O at the top of the rotation, who's beat us once in the series already. Warren Yao, who beat us in the other time we placed the Buzzards. <laughs> Bay Paul, who's rattled, uh, and then of course uh, in the bullpen they have Buzz past them. Amazo Hayes, Bob Hurlington the fourth, BH4, Tucker Turlington, and Omar Chambo. Let's dive into it here. Hunter's first pitch of the game. He's up and away is pop foul by Tools out of play. 0-1. Oh, in. That is high. 1-1. Well down in the way. Chopped through the middle, seeing eye single under the glove of of uh, Hunter, that is a leadoff single for Tools. Good start for her. Atop the Buzzards lineup, here's third baseman Peak Physique, who's already locked in coming into today's game. Hitting 345 with two homers, the six RBIs on the air. No threat to run our first as Tools, but do be mindful of the. Uh, as that's dropped by Clark, as I miss let that go too early, I'd be mindful of the uh, hit and run. It's always a possibility, especially with how good of a hitter Peak is. Slider down, that is hitting the hole to right field, that is a base hit as he found the gap and put it in there. Two on, none down to start the inning for the Buzzards as they're in business for Hautier. Second baseman hitting 360, two RBIs on the air. Slider inside on the first pitch, just off the plate, ball one. Horse in the middle of the way, his broken bat fouled off over the screen, 1-1. One, one. Ball middle in, rip foul by Hautier, out of play, one and two. Wilford now activate for Javier. Cut up and away. Swing through it, strike three, first punch up for Hunter, one down. Man and Moon up next, center fielder locked in. Hit the power of his righty active, a max boost, hitting 423. Four homers on the year already for Manon and nine RBIs. He's hitting pretty well here. Got the cleanup roll right now for the Buzzards. Ball down and in on the first pitch, whiff through it high, a one as he swung over the top of it. Goes it down in the way, checked low, good hold, 1-1. One, one. Better up and in, sky to center, Swanson back a few steps to his left, or right. Makes catch for the second out as the lead runner tags, going for third, throw in from Swanson, just late. Runners at the corners, two down here for the Buzzards for Tara Leonair, the first baseman today. She's hitting 158 with three RBIs in the air. Leonair is normally the primary catcher, but she moves to first base today. As Peak Physique slots over to third today. Come down on the first pitch in the dirt. Ball one. Slider put in. Taking. Oh, it's a strike. I thought it was high. 1 1. Forcing it down and in. Hit up the middle to second. Whoopie to his right. Backhands cleanly to first. That ends the inning as Hunter strands two in the first. To the second, it's still 2 nothing heaters. Swanson, Whoopity, and Clark do up against Neomo. Here's rookie Stanley Swanson leading off the heaters in the second, hitting 423. Two RBIs on the air. Neomo back to neutral here. First pitch heater down and in is low. Ball one. Next heater up and in is inside, and Swanson doesn't even flinch as it's up near his hands. 2 0. Fastball up and in. Roped up the middle to center base hit. Good rip through it by the rookie as he's on the lead off the second for the heaters. Hmm. <sighs> 
Hard me slope will put up next. Second baseman hitting 214. No homers, no RBIs on the air. Sloop having another down year, offensively speaking. First pitch heater in there at the letters. Away, a one. Pick off the first. They knew he was going. Good job by Neomo, and that's going to be an easy out. It's second as Swanson is picked off. That pick officer trait coming in clutch there for her. Uh, that is Swanson's first attempt to steal all year. He is 0 for 1. Well, we won the count to Whoopity. Cut up and away, dumped to right field. Softly leaping as Hautier to pick it out of the air. Two down. Base is empty for catcher Fiona Clark, hitting 375. One RBI in the air. Slider down is chased in the dirt, grounded softly to short. Tools to her right, makes the stop, and that ends the inning. Bottom two, it's nothing happening here. 2 0. Jones, Pruitt, and Spooner do up here for the Buzzards. Left fielder Filet Jones leads off in the sixth slot today for the Buzzards, hitting 333 with a homer, six RBIs for the perennial power threat. Pushing her up and away, that is fouled back off the end of the bat. 0 oh, 1. Cut her down in the way, chased it low out of the zone, 0 oh, 2. Better fit in. Take it high. One, two. Good take. How about down and in. Fouled off into the dugout. One, two. Push him down in the way. Whiffed over the top of it. Strike three. Second punch out for Hunter. Two. One down in the inning. Here's rookie Edwin Pruitt, the right fielder, hitting 200. Four RBIs on the year. Getting the start today over Johnny Bags. As Bags is not only tense, he's also injured. Cutter been away in the first pitch, strike called, a one nipping the outside corner. Slider down and in, strike called as Pruitt takes, 0-2. Curveball down and away, checked outside, good hold by the rookie, 1-2. Here's him in, checked out of the zone, good high, good eye high, 2-2. Sign Steeler activates, Cutter away, pop down the right field line, Bambino going over, won't get there as it's down and the at-bat continues. Count remains at 2-2. Slider down and in. Chopped off to the third base line. Hunter over. Fires to first. In time. Two down. Good job to react on the swinging bunt as she fields her position. Next up is Cozy Spooner, the third year catcher. Locked in with bad ball hitter active, hitting 500. One RBI in the air. Cut open in the first pitch. Strike called. 0 1. Double down the way. Fouled off behind this back into the backstop. 0 2 the count to Spooner. Pours him down and in, just inside off the plate, one, two. Good take from Spooner. Slider pin away, popped up behind the plate. Clark is there out of the crouch. And she puts it away, one, two, three, hitting for Hunter in the second. To the third, it's two nil. Hunter will lead off, then Swiner and Bambino, nine, one, and two for the heaters. Reese Hunter leading off, hit this on the air. She's gonna start it against Neomo here in the third. First pitch change up in there at the letters, 0 1. Slider put away, foul back, 0 2. Cutter up his chase, popped up behind second base, Hautier there, 1 down. Buck Swiner up next, big country over 1 today. Change up up, strike called, 0 1. Slider put in, way high and inside, 1 1. Change up and in, ripped foul out of the play. One and two to Big Country. Change it down, pulled to right field softly. That is down in front of Pruitt for a base hit. Big Country's first hit today. He's one for two. He's on for Bambino, who doubled and scored on the homer later in the first inning. He's one for one and still locked in. Peter taking low, ball one. Cutter up in, rope to center field, that is down for a base hit. Back-to-back -back singles here with one down for the heaters, put us in business. So that's going to bring up the three hitter today, Norm Phenomeno, who homered his first time up, hitting one just over the wall in dead center. Two runs shot, as that's the only run scored so far for either club. Slider hangs on the first pitch, crushed dead center field, he's looking to do it again. Not quite high enough this time as it's off the wall in dead center. Double for Phenomeno. Both runners will score. It is four to nothing heaters as he's scored all four runs today. Driven in, I should say. Next up, Keg Gutterson. 0 for 1 with RBI. Hero active. He's still locked in. 
Slider from the way, rope to right center. That's down for a base hit, and Phenomeno's going to score easily on this one as Pruitt just getting to it. Throw in is cut by Leonair. It is an RBI knock for Gutterson. 5 nothing heaters. As Norm has either driven in all the runs or scored all of them. Next up is Grunt Manley, 0 for 1 today. Granted out his first time up. Cutter in the dirt, taking low, ball one. Change bumping in, rope foul, one and one. Cutter up and away, line softly to third, right at physique for the second out of the inning. Runner still at first for Swanson, who singled his first time up, and it was picked off trying to steal second. Stanley one for one today. Slider taking low in the dirt, ball one. Fast down and in, strike called on the cutter, one one. Change of mail to play. Hard rip under the glove of third baseman physique as he dives late. Our, our second hit for Swanson. He's two for two. Two on, two down here for the Heaters. Keeping it alive for Whoopity, who's 0 for 1. Popped out the second his first time up. Or lined out softly, I should say. But that's going to do it for Keo Neomo. She only goes two and two third innings today. Coming out of the bullpen is righty Amazo Hayes, who's locked in. Neomo goes two and two thirds. She gives up five earned runs, eight hits, one homer, no strikeouts. No walks, runners on base, her responsibilities if they score. Let's take a look at Hayes' numbers on the air. Amazo on the season 1-0. He has a 180 ERA and a 120 whip. Two runs given up, one earned in five appearances. It's the second most out of the bullpen. Five innings pitched, four hits surrendered. Army, two walks, six strikeouts, batting average against 200, and there are his advanced numbers. Pretty solid. He delivers, curveball down and in, strike call to Whoopity 0 1. Sliders in the dirt, 1 1. Work ball down, popped up to center, easy play out there in center for Moon. He'll put it away to end the inning. Three home here, double, two run double by Phenomeno, and then an RBI knock by Gutterson. 5 0 to the bottom of the third as Neomo's out after two and two thirds. Hayes, Tools, and Physique do up against Hunter. <laughs> Hayes leading off is now on fire after getting out of the jam here last inning, getting the last out of the third inning. Hitless on the air. Cut her up on the first pitch, strike called, middle top of the zone, 0-1. Oh, Ball down the way, outside, 1-1. One one. Down and in, strike called, 1-2. Right up and away. Hit off the end of the bat at the middle of the short, diving phenomenal off his glove, and that's going to be a knock for Hayes, his first hit of the season. Lead off man on in the third for the Buzzards. Here's Tools, one for one with a single or first time up. We're seeing down in the way, strike call to one. Slider pin in, just inside, one one. Down and in, pulled foul out of play. His tools out in front, one and two. Got everyone away. Checked out of the zone, two two. Down and in, Griff jammed her up the middle. Diving phenomeno out of his reach, another base hit. Two on to start the inning, none down here for the Buzzards. Here's Physique, one for one with a single his first time up. He's locked in still, looking to deliver for the Buzzards. Slider down and in on the first pitch, chopped foul late to one. Jim up and away, whiffed on it outside of the zone, 0-2. Cut up and in, taken high and tight out of the zone, 1-2. Go down the way, chased outside and foul back, still 1-2. and Came up and away. Chased out of the zone, hitting the hole to first. Manly dives out of his reach under the glove of Whoopity as well. Bases loaded now with none down as that's three singles to start the inning for the Buzzards. Nowhere to put him. Here's Hautier. 0 for 1 with the strikeout today. He's tense. Hunter getting some bad luck here in the inning with three seeing eye singles. One hard hit, one off the diving glove of Phenomena. One hard hit back up the middle. And then one seeing eye knock between first and second. <laughs> Fire at the knees on the first pitch, strike call to one is nip the bottom of the zone there. Cut up and in. Jammed him foul over the screen, 0-2. Oh, 
him up and away. Chased it high out of the zone. Strike three. Punch out for Hunter. One down in the inning. Here's Moon over one. I believe that is Hunter's third today. She came in here with uh, seven. She's now at tens. So that was her third. Bases remain low to one down for Man and Moon, who's hitting pretty well still. Well, down the way in the first pitch, rope the second right on the line to whoop it. Two down, bases remain loaded. Here comes Leonair, 0 for 1. All the pressure on Leonair to try and get a run in with the bases loaded. Here's him up and away, foul back over the screen, 0 1. Better up and in, chased off the plate, fouled off, 0 2. Well, down the way. Fouled off, back into this backstop, still 0-2. Five down and in, low in the dirt, one and one and two the count. Pushing her up and away, chased high out of the zone, fouled off, still one and two. Better up and in, Leonair jammed it, foul behind the screen, still one and two. Slider middle in. Whiffed on it, strike three, and Hunter strands the bases loaded with none down. Striking out two. She's up to four now on the day, to the fourth. It's 5-0. Clark, Hunter, and Swiner do have good pitching from Reese. The sophomore showing great metal and fortitude to bend but not break. Clark leading off of one today, looking to start it here against Hayes in the fourth. Either up then called a stray. High, ball one. Changeable wave, ripped up the middle on the ground, base hit for Clark, as that is her first hit today. She's one for two. Lead off woman on for the pitcher, Hunter, but we are up five runs already. There's no need to bunt. That would be rude. Let's swing away. Infield is playing the bunt defense, though. Slider away, strike call to one. Change up and way high and out of the zone, one, one. Hayes down to locked in mojo. Changeable wave, popped up, shallow right field. Pruitt racing in, will get there for the first out. Top of the lineup, here we come. It is Buck Swiner up next. Big Country singled last time up. He's one for two. Reverse splits active for the first time today for Hayes, taking down Swiner's hitting ratings by minus 10 power and minus 15 contact. Changeup misses inside from Hayes. Ball one. Changeup down and in. Chase low by Buck. Out of play. 1 1. Slider outside, taken off the plate. 2 1. Change it down. Rope foul out in front of it. 2 2. Change about in front of it, middle end, strike three. First punch up for Hayes out of the pen. Two down in the inning, runner still at first for Bambino. Locked in two for two, singled last time up. He's also doubled. Scored twice as well. Hayes on fire again. Slider up, hangs, chased out of the zone. Sky ball to center. Moon in, calling for it, and he puts it away to end the inning. Bottom four, it's still 5 nothing. Jones, Pruitt, and Spooner do up against Hunter. Here's Flay Jones, he's 0 for 1 today. Cut her down in the way in the first pitch, just off the plate outside. Ball one. Looking up and in. Chased inside, jammed foul behind the screen. 1 1. Roll down and in. Chase low, grounded the short. He rolled over on it. Phenomeno fields cleanly. On to first, 1 down. Next up, Pruitt, the rookie, over one today with a pop out. Cut her up and in. Taken inside. Ball one. Pressing the middle in. Fouled back, jammed him, 1-1. Right up and away, chased it high out of the zone, 1-2. Down and away, chased in the dirt, off the punter's glove behind the mound. Whoopity bare hands and fires, late infield single for Pruitt, as that was just unlucky there. Spooner up next, he's 0-1 today, the catcher. Still locked in despite that. For ball away on the first pitch, that is fouled back, 0-1. Slider down and in, grounded the second. Whoopity do his left, cuts it off, flips the second one. Phenomenal to first. Double play. You love to see it. So that ends the inning to the fifth. It's 5 0. Phenomenal, Gutterson, and Manley. Hard lineup coming up for the heaters again. Phenomenal up. He doubled home two last time at the plate. He also hit a two run homer earlier in the game. He's driven in four runs and scored twice as well. Hayes' reverse splits to act as he's now on fire. Let's see if he can get Norm out. 
Changing up the knees, rope to first off the glove of Leonair, but she recovers the haze in time, one down. Gutterson up next, singled home a run last time up. He's one for two today. Still locked in. Sider hangs in the first pitch, rip foul, a one. Pass up and in, broken back grounder to third. Easy play for Bazik to his left, two down. Base is empty for Grunt Manley, he's over two. Reverse splits active again for Hayes. Change of middle in, strike call to one. Here up the way, strike call to two. Fork ball down, pulled softly to right center field. Hanging up though for Pruitt, and that's a one, two, three inning. Hayes gets through the heart of the lineup easily. Bottom five, Hayes, tools, and physique do up. Hayes leads off, singled his first time up, and then was stranded at third base. And pinch hitting for him as he's done after two and a third innings of relief. It is Rusty Buston, the first baseman, 333 average, two every guys on the year. The 21 year old, former Moonstar prospect. Well, down the way on the first pitch from Hunter, bounces in the dirt, ball one. Forcing it down and in, low and inside, 2 0. Got her up and away, chased high, foul back, 2 1. Got her in. Grounded hard to short, one hopper to Phenomena, he'll make the play. One down. Yeah, it's tools up next, 2 for 2 today with two singles, trying to get it started here in the fifth inning. Slider going away on the first pitch, hangs in the middle of the zone, and that is going to be another knock into center. Third hit today for Tools as she's on to, with one down in the fifth. Peak Vizik up next, 2 for 2 today with two singles. He's locked in. Peak up and down the first pitch, blew it by him, high and in tight, 0-1. Oh, Cut her down in the way, strike call, but caught the knees, 0-2. Oh, Hunter forging ahead. Rub up and away. Outside and low. One and two. Slide down and in. Chased it inside. Strike three. Fifth punch out for Hunter. Two down. And here's Hautier. 0 for 2 today. Intense. Number 17, Javier away in the first pitch. Lined hard to short. One hopper. Phenomenal over to his left. Fields it cleanly to first. That ends the inning. Good pitching from Hunter. She's through the fifth. Coming out of the bullpen next is BH4 for the Buzzards as he'll take over on the mound. He's tense. To the sixth. Swanson, Wolpity, and Clark do up as we're still winning 5 to nothing. Swanson leads off. Ricky 2 for 2 today with two singles. She's also been caught stealing once today. RH4 now out of the or BH4 now out of the bullpen as he'll take over. Bob Harlington, the fourth, who, if you've watched my Saw Teeth franchise, you are very familiar with him. No record, a 4.15 ERA and a 2.08 whip. Four runs given up, two earned in four appearances. One save out of the bullpen. Four and a third innings pitch, six hits surrendered, three walks, one hit batsman, four strikeouts, and batting average against 300. And there are his advanced numbers for those that are curious. He's ready. Here we go. Heater away outside. Ball one. Heater down and in his low from Harlington. 2-0. Slider from away, hit well off the end of the bat to center, chasing back. There is Moon to his right. He'll make the catch, though, easily. One down. Look whoopity up next. He's over 2 today. Still looking to find his footing today. Work ball up, strike call to 1. Slider middle wing, chops the roll to third. Physique over on it. Makes the play, 2 down. Whoopity now 10, that'll bring up Clark. 1 for 2 with a single K. Travis Lefty is now active for the first time today, though. See if she can make use of it. It's Mr. Rawls, pal. Almost beamed her inside with that fastball. She ducks back out of the way. 1-0. He's back to neutral, though. Slider down and then rope the middle on the ground. Base hit. As Clark gets her second hit today. She's 2-3. for And that will keep the inning alive for the pitcher, Reese Hunter, who's over 2 today, but still locked in. Well, and grounded out. Change up, pulled off the end of the bat to left field softly. Easy catch for Jones, and that will end the inning. Bottom six, it's 5 0. No. Moon, Leonair, and Jones do up against Hunter. Here's Moon, 0 for 2 today. Looking to get it started here in the sixth. Go down and in on the first pitch, struck called the knees, 0 1. Cut her up and away, checked outside, 1 1. 
Push him down the way. Low and outside. 2 1. Let it in. Chased it inside. 2 2. Fire down and in. Ripped hard. Foul by Moon. He stays alive at 2 2. Fire down the way. Chased off the zone. Fouled off. Still 2 2. Ripped away. Whiffed on it. Strike three. Blew it by us. Six punch out for Hunter. What the hell? Here's Leonero for two today. Or he's going to be down the way on the first pitch. Chop off the end of the bat to short. Phenomenon to his left makes the play. Two down. Quick start the inning for Hunter. Here's Jones over two. All right, down the way. Chopped foul out of play. 0-1. Nothing in. Chased it inside off the plate. 0-2 as Hunter gets ahead again. Go down and in. Low and inside. Good take. 1-2. Cutter up and away. Chased and fouled off. Do it again. Still 1-2. Let's see it in inside. Checked out of the zone. 2-2. Go down the way. Whiffed on it. Strike three. Seven punch out for Hunter. And that ends the inning. Matching her total from her first start this year to the seventh, it's 5 0. Swiner, Big Country, Bambino, and Phenomeno do up. Here's Big Country. He's one for three today with the same. Pardon me, can he deliver his second hit of the game? First with slider down and in from Harlington is low. Ball one. Fork ball hangs. Crushed the left center field, but got under it is Big Country. Over 4 2 is right as the center fielder Moon. One down. So Jovan Bambino up next. Two through the double and a single. He's locked in. Change of hangs on the first pitch. Turned on down the right field line. Hit pretty well deep into the corner. Will it have the legs? Not quite. As it's a shock up. Pruitt there makes the catch of the one and track. Two down. A simple for Phenomeno. Two for three today with a two run homer and a two run double. Driving in four. Lined out last time up. Peter up and in strike call to one. Change down and then rip foul, 2 Heater up and in, jammed him up the middle of the short, cut off by tools behind the bag. 1-2-3 inning here for the heaters in the 7th. Bottom 7, it's 5 nil. Pruitt, Spooner, and BH4 do up. Here's Pruitt, rookie 1 for 2 today with a single last time at the plate. Rushing up and in on the first pitch, strike call, 0-1. Or down the way, foul to off, 0-2. Better down and in, low and inside, one and two. Better get away, fouled off, still one and two. Push him down and away, chased off the plate, still one and two. Couple down and in, sign sealer active, taking them to dirt, two two. Better up and in, fouled off, still two two. Pitch number 96 coming from Hunter here to start the seventh. Heater down in the way, hitting the hollow with a short. Phenomena there's right back hands cleanly on to first. One down, nice battle there. Next up, Spooner, catcher of two today. Fire down in on the first pitch, grounded hard to third. Gutterson there on the hop, makes the play. Two down. Base empty for BH4, pinch hitter coming. It is Yips Frazzo, the infielder, 231 average, one homer, two RBIs on the air. Better been away on the first pitch, strike call, 0 1. Go down and in. Ripped hard foul out of play, 0 2. Is he ripping in? High inside off the plate, 1 and 2. Pitch number 101 now coming from Hunter. Fire down the way. Chased it. Fooled him in the dirt. Picked by Clark. She'll fire to first. That ends the inning. Eighth punch up for Hunter today. She gets out of the seventh. Top of the eighth we go. Coming out of the bullpen. Lefty Tucker Turlington as he'll take over on the mound. Gutterson, Manley, and Swanson do up here. Four, five, and six for the heaters in the eighth. Gutterson leads off. One for three. RBI single earlier in the game. Facing... Uh, Turlington now out of the pen, the third reliever used by, or third pitcher used today by the Buzzards. 
Sterling to no and two. He has a 1080 ERA and a 360 whip. Five runs given up, four earned, and four appearances. Three and a third innings pitch, nine hits surrendered, three walks, one homer, four strikeouts, batting average against a 450, and there are his advanced stats for you as well. See how it goes here. Pitcher sets, fires, slider in the side, misses, ball one off the plate from Turlington. Way outside with the curve, 2-0. Throw out the knees, rope the left center field into the gap. That's going to be extra bases for Gutterson as it rolls all the way to the fence, almost. Moon gets it in quickly, but it is still a leadoff double for Gutterson. From Manley on next, he's 0 for 3. RBI hero active though for the first time today. We'll see if he can make use of it. He up away high, ball one. Four pulled down and then crushed by Grunt Manley, deep right center field. That's got some carry to it, heading back to the wall. Fireball coming at you there as it lands in the, uh, just over the fence in right center in front of the wave wall. Fourth home of the year for Grunt Manley as that puts us up 7 to nothing now as we are breaking it open here late. Not bad at all. Big uh, rookie Staley Swats is up next. Two for three today with two singles and once caught stealing. Heater up and away, strike called and turned to no one as he's still tense. Little down and in in the dirt, bounces 1-1. Triple hangs, roped hard to left on the line, but right at Jones. One down, he barely had to move. Next up, slip up at his second baseman, tense so over three today. We are going to pinch hit for him as he doesn't have it. Going to go ahead and give the bat to do Goose Caboosler. Two five off the bench here on the season with one RBI. Can pinch perfect deliver one more time for the utility infielder. Work ball hangs, roped to right center field, hit pretty well. That's carrying. One hop to the fence there in right center. Booster going to be in with a pinch hit double here. One down in the eighth. Next up, Fiona Clark. 2 for 3 today with two singles. Power was lefty active still. Asper down. Popped up foul. That's going to get out of play. A 1. Asper up. Chased high. Oh, out of the zone. 0 2. Go down his chase. Number to third. Go to second, they got the runner in the rundown, and the runner out of third. Two down for Hunter, and she'll be pinch hit here in the eighth as she goes seven quality innings today, throwing over 100 pitches, giving up no runs on seven hits, striking out eight. Not a bad outing for Hunter. We off the bench to pinch hit here is going to go ahead and be, let's give it to outfielder Cash Money Basket. She's got the traits active, power and contact versus lefty. Hitting 400 off the bench with two RBIs. Slider up and away, high and outside. Ball one. Fastball up and away, high. Two out of the count. Fastball up, hard rope in the center field as Basquette delivers a pinch hit knock. Two one, two down now as the heaters are in business. Back to the top of the lineup here is Big Country. One for the single today. Still volatile. Ladder up in, taken high, ball one. Work ball down and then is low, 2-0 the count to Buck. Fast one middle of the plate, hit the knees, ripped up the middle base hit. We're coming around third, it's going to try and score, comes the throw from Moon, it is cut by Leonair. And Swiner hangs in there with a single, 8 nothing heaters. Runners at the corners, two down for Bambino, he's locked in still, double and a single today, 2-4. Either way hard, ground or foul, 0-1. They're both away, taken high and outside, 1-1, one, one, good eye. Either way outside, 2-1, good hold by Bambino. They're both away outside, 3-1. They're both in, roped hard to second, one hopper to Hautier, he makes the play to first, that ends the inning. Alrighty, we're going to let Basquette come out. We are going to leave um, Caboosler in to play second. Coming out of the bullpen here with the big lead. I'm going to go ahead and turn it over to... I haven't used Never Walker in a while. He might be getting a little rusty. Yeah, let's go ahead and turn it over to... Um... Yeah, let's turn it over to Never Walker. Get him an appearance here. He hasn't pitched in a while. Tools, Physique, and Hautier do up. Here's Tools, 3-for-3 three three today with three singles at the top lineup, facing Never Walker for the first time today. 
Dirt on the year, no record, a zero ERA, and a zero whip. No runs given up, one appearance out of the bullpen, one save, one inning and a third. No hits given up, no batting average against, two strikeouts. And Durr's advanced numbers for you. Pitched really well in his one appearance this year. Let's see how he does in his second. It's been a while since he's been out there on the mound. First pitch cutter up and away to Tools. Turned on, belted down the line and left, but out of play. Off, uh, out of play, 0-1 as it's in the stands. Down the way, fouled off back into the screen, 0-2. Up and in. Chased it inside, strike three. First punch up for Never Walker, one down. Peak physique up next. He got stimulated. He's now juiced and locked in. Two for three today with two singles. Good slider down and then low, ball one. Well down, chased in the dirt, one one. Push him up the way. Chased outside and fouled off, one two. Cut up and in. Chased it high, strike three. Second punch up for Neverwalker. Two down. Back to back case, start the outing. Here's Hautier, 0 for 3 and still tense. Hautier. Slider low and away, taken. Ball one as it misses. Two up and away. Roped hard to right field, hit pretty well. Tracking at Bambino, he'll watch it hit off the fence. Gets it in quickly. That is going to be a two out knock there. So that's the first hit today. For that, as Manning Moon comes in, he's up for three today. First hit for who? That was first hit for Hotier today. First pitch forcing him down and into Moon. Roped hard to left field, it heading into the corner, slicing away from Buck. He can't get there. So one hops to the fence. The country gets it in quickly. It's going to be a double for Moon. Two in scoring position now. Two down in the eighth. Here's Leonair. Up for three today. The ball way in the first pitch with low under the knees, 0 1. Ripping in, strike called, 0 2. There's him ripping away. Chase the pop foul, giving Chase Gutterson near the dugout. Makes the catch, and that ends the inning as Neville Walker strands 2 to the ninth. That's 8 0. Hard to line up one more time for the heaters today Phenomeno, Gutterson, and Manley. Phenomeno leads off, 2 for 4 today, he's driven in 4 runs total, 2 on a homer, 2 on a double. See how he does here against Turlington, who's tiring. Slider up, strike called with letters, 0-1. Pork ball at the knees, rope to center field, base hit. Single for Norm. He is now a triple shot of the cycle here as he leads off the ninth with the base hit. Gutterson up next, 2-4. RBI single earlier in the game. He also doubled. Still locked in. Slider from late. Pardon me, taken high. Ball one. Either way, strike called, 1-1. Pass from up and in, jammed him to left center, soft liner, down in front of Jones for a base hit. 2-1, none down to start the inning for the Heaters. Here's Manley. Two-run homer last time up, he's 1-4 today, and RBI Heroes active again. King Grunt deliver one more time. Work ball from the way, strike call, 0-1. Pass from middle in, jammed him, blooped to right center field, sinking quickly. Getting there is Pruitt, though, for the first out. Next up going to be Stanley Swanson, working two for four today with two singles and one time caught stealing on the base pass. Heater up and away, strike call to one. Work ball outside misses badly, one one. Work ball down and in, jam slow roll to short, tools to second one, Hautier to first. Dropped E3 by Leonair as that keeps the angle alive for Kabusler. One form with the double today. Turlington done after an inning and two thirds. Coming out of the bullpen is long reliever Buzz past him as he'll take over on the mound. Buzz on the season, no record, a zero ERA and a 097 whip. No runs given up in six appearances. 11 and third innings pitched, most out of the bullpen. Nine hits given up, two walks, seven strikeouts, three hit bats, been batting average against 237, and his advanced stats for you. No doubt he's been the best performing reliever for the Buzzards this season so far. We're going to get Caboosler out in strand two at the corners. First pitch from Buzz. Change up up the two seamer from away. Or change up, I think it was two seamer strike call to one. Pass up with Lado two. Two seamer from away. Pop foul behind the screen. Uh, or behind this plate, I should say. 
Spooner puts it away as it stays in there to end the inning. Bottom nine is 8 0. Jones, Pruitt, and Spooner do up. Here's Jones, up 3 today in tense. Never Walker looking for the two inning uh, hold here. Repping in the first pitch strike call, the one. Better win the next pitch foul back, 0 2. Well, down and in. Chased it in the dirt, strike three, third punch up for Durr, one down. Next up, Evan Pruitt, rookie one for three with a single today. Cut up in the first pitch for a tarred foul, one. Bless you, slider down and in low, one, one. Push him down the way. Grounded the third, right at Gutterson, he'll make the play across. Two down here in the ninth. Buzzer down to the last out today. Here's Cozy Spooner, the catcher of three. No pinch hitter coming. It's his at bat. Cutter up in the first pitch. Strike call, the one. He's going to be down and in. Hit up the middle of the second. Base hit into right center. That keeps the game alive. It's about not for the buzzer there from Spooner. His first hit today. He's one for four. Now bring up the pitcher slot. Past him. Pinch hitting for him is outfielder Johnny Baggs, who's still tense and injured, hitting 273 with a homer and an RBI in the air. And he deliver and keep the game alive. Right up and win the first pitch high, ball one. Takes him down and in. Chop slow roll to short, phenomenal high hops it in. Fires the first in time to end the inning and the game as the heaters shut down the buzzards easily. We beat them for the first time here in the series. We win 8 0 the final. Yes, perfect. Good offensive day for us as we score in a couple of innings here and had double-digit hits again. And really great pitch performance as well as Neverwalker and Hunter slammed the door today. Pitching lines hitless today. Whoopity for us as well as Hunter and Neverwalker who didn't bat. On the other side for the Buzzards, hitless today were Lee and Aaron Jones as well as uh, Neoma who never got the chance to bat. Bust them the pinch hitter, Frazzler. And the other pinch hitter, which was uh, Johnny Bags there at the end. No runs driven in for them. Our runs were driven in. Uh, two, four for day for Phenomeno. He had a two-run homer and a two-run double. Big Country had an RBI single. Uh, Gutterson an RBI single. Manley had a two-run homer. Pitching lines, Hunter, seven innings, seven hits given up, eight strikeouts. Quality start for her. She improves to 2-0. and oh. Neverwalker, two inning hold, three hits given up, three strikeouts. And on the other side, Neoma only two and two thirds today. Eight hits, giving up five run runs on a homer. She falls to one and one on the year. Hayes two and a third innings, one hit, one strikeout. Uh, Hurlington two innings, one hit. Hurlington inning and two thirds, seven hits, three run runs, one homer, and past them a third of an inning. Phenomenal the player of the game is he was a triple shot of the cycle today, driving in four runs, followed by Reese Hunter for her quality seven innings, and then Kay Gutterson with his three hit day, driving in a run on a single. Not bad, not bad. I like it. Big win, big win. Yeah, I'm exhausted. This is going to be the only one tonight, guys. All right, what do we got? Any manager moments? Let's find out. Okay, a couple players feeling blue about not playing today, but you don't have time for everyone who do not have time to cover tomorrow. Easy to Grande's killing it this year. Uh, Champion Sports Equipment has, called, has some uh, complimentary split bands. Okay, and one left. Who gets it? Kerr or Neverwalker? Neverwalker. Make him a little cheaper. He's definitely the best pitcher. Looking around the league, okay. All right, Bellamy up all signs to the Bullfish. He'll replace Air Lovestone in their rotation. Alberto Roberto, uh, released by the Nemesis. He'll be replaced by starter Rusty Nozzle. Ron Gell, plus one speed on a random roll. And that's it. Everyone else still intact. Mm, which one did I like the best? I don't remember. Ooh, contact for Fiona. She definitely needs that. That's a good one right there. Not giving you easy jumps. I think it was this one for Dick Lucas. Yeah. Because I think the trade outweighed the one for DeGrande. Yeah. Let's go ahead and grab Dick Lucas's here. Get two accuracy to 68. Not get the bonus five. Going for pick officer here. Does not get it either. 
Unfortunate, one day we'll hit a trait though. Lucas gets a tiny bit better in the meantime. And then next up, we're probably going to grab this one for Clark, which will be available in two games. Or we could just chill, cop out and get one of these for probably Lovelorn here, but three games, I don't think it's going to be here. Unfortunate, but it is the way it is. All right, so to the next one here for the heaters is we are now heading into the final game of the regular season's first half next episode. All right, the Sandcats have their first loss as they lost the last place Blowfish. That's the last undefeated team left in the season. Big Beebles beat Platypi there. Wide let's take it on the Crocs. Wide let's do win 3 to 2. Free bidders win. Nice. Love it. Nemesis taking on the Overdogs. We do play the Nemesis next episode and they get throttled today 11 to 3. All right. Grapplers and Jacks. Grapplers going to win easily as they keep pace with us. Still a half game back. Sandcats bounce back to win their next game against the Blowfish, splitting that double header, and then the Buzzards shut out the Wild Oats 2-0. Yeah, this is still looking like a two-team race in our division. Uh, keep our heads up and just, you know, keep rolling right along. Keep doing what we're doing. That's all we can do. Next episode is the halfway mark of the regular season as we take on the 3-5 and five Nemesis on the mound for them as veteran Fran Japani. 0-1 with a 5-6-2 ERA and a 1-1-2 whip and some decent traits as well. Lead 2 seamer and volatile. And for us, it is rookie left-hander C.T. Brazon with the elite slider trade. He is 10, so in one with a 21.60 ERA and a 3.80 whip as he got roughed up in his first outing this season, looking to bounce back this second time out, trying to earn that spot, keep that spot on the roster. All right, we'll set the lineup here and call it a day for next episode. Big uh, Slam us will lead us off at shortstop next time out, followed by Jovan Bambino in right field. Phenomena slots over to second base. He'll bat third. Grump Manley batting fourth at first base. Gutterson locked in in third. He'll bat fifth. Swiner, big country out in left field. He'll bat sixth. DeGrande back in at the catcher. He'll bat seventh against the righty. Batting eighth is 10th center fielder rookie Stanley Swanson. Batting ninth is 10th rookie pitcher C.T. Brazon. All right, and that is going to do it for this episode today, guys. Big win today against the Buzzards as we beat them for the first time in the series, shutting them out 8 to nothing. With that win, we're now 6-1, heading into the final game of the regular season's first half, looking to retain our division lead against the Nemesis. Can we do it? Tune in next time to find out. You made it this deep in the video, guys. Thanks so much for sticking around. I appreciate the support as always. If you haven't already, hit the follow and or subscribe buttons here down below on Twitch to be notified next time I go live. And if you haven't already over on YouTube, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe to the channel. I mean, thank you, Twitch. Link to Twitch is down in the description below if you want to come over and watch the games live before they're posted. And also follow me over on this platform if you so choose. That's going to do it for me tonight, guys, as we win another 1 8 0 the final. Let's see if we can keep this momentum going into the next game against the Nemesis. Until next time, this is the Nasty One. Signing off. Have a wonderful evening, everybody.